Hey guys, now today I'm gonna be showing you guys. I'm gonna be showing you guys or doing a video. Um, I know this is weird. Hang on. Just turn the light on. Okay. Basically, what I have behind me, right over here, is selections of stuff. Well, not selections, but today I'm gonna be talking about mealworms. Um, yeah, my meat, the mealworms that we got, how they're doing. And, uh, what they're looking like. So basically, you have two separate containers. One container is made for hangers. And uh, let's take this potato out. They're not really eating it much. And uh, we freeze them because they're meat for lizards. Meat for me, lizards eating it. Um, we feed them potatoes. There's two potatoes in here. I gotta find the other one. There we go. They eat the uh, potatoes and freezing them uh, or putting them in the fridge and I guess freezing them uh, slows down the metamorphosis and they stay larva for a lot longer of time. As you can tell, we have little babies. This one just molted and it's just uh, shed or molted, whatever you want to call it. it. That doesn't mean it's turning into a uh, pupa because... In order to be pupa, they have to be much bigger. So this is what, this is for uh, lizard food, because we have, if you don't know, we have, uh, let me pop a picture, Pixie and Spot. Pixie and Spot, and sorry for the giant uh, watermark right here, because, um, yeah, I'm working on removing that soon. But, um, yeah, as you can see, right here, this is, uh, that, this is for Pixie and Spot. So let's put this back, but they're, um, we'll just, keep their potatoes for now and move them over to the side over here and next up we're going to be grabbing the mealworms that are we're not feeding these these are actually the ones that are turning into pupa and they're going to be turning into beetles soon and making more beetles and laying eggs and then we're going to have tons of more mealworms for feeding because we have a special new things that i want to show you so let's move on the, let's move these potatoes to the side for right now as you can tell, they are chomping up on these. We're going to put these beetles to the side. Uh, and eat these uh, food. These guys are... Hang on. Let me grab this guy. This guy, actually. Okay. As you can tell, these mealworms are much larger. These are the mealworms that are turning into pupa. And um, I want to show you the pupa, actually. So let's move these guys aside quickly. Because I also have to do something to the pupa. Um, right here, boom, we're gonna grab this, and then boom, we're gonna grab this. This is the container right now. Let me just remove this. The container that we are keeping our pupa, um, our pupa in. Let me get all the pupa out. Three, two, one. Welcome back. Um, I've just got all the pupa taken out of their spots. And sadly, Two died. So yeah, this is what their home looks like right now. And um, I looked over here, no more pupa. So we're gonna put their nice little uh, put their potatoes back in their spots, right here. Close, seal them back up, and uh, hopefully we get more pupa soon. So, they go back right here. Now this container has nothing in it. As you can see, nothing. So, we're probably gonna come see this, and uh, maybe fill it up with something else. I don't know, but this is where the people are going to be from now on. We're going to put them right next to them. And let's put these frozen guys in the back and we'll put their potato back. Well, they are all put back. And let's show you what we're doing now that we have all these guys. I'm gonna show you this prize. I told you guys about. 
over here we have something we're also feeding these we're gonna lay the eggs of the mealworms for something um this is the new expedition i just got i know i haven't been posting about them sorry about that but here we go this is uh our newest additions to the family we got six little chicks um i mean Six, the six chicks, their names are Penny, Daisy. Oh. Daisy's the only black one. That's so Penny, Daisy, um, Sadie, Poppy, Patty, and Sadie, uh, Molly, 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 Molly. So yeah, those are all the chicks. I know this video was short, but this is where they sit. they're staying right now. I'm actually gonna hold Daisy. Let me go grab her. Hey, Daisy, come here. They're just freaking out. I don't know why they're freaking out, but. Oh, turn the light on. And, whoa. They're getting so big. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. So, oh my. Hello. So, yeah, this is Daisy. Um, she is huge right now. She's getting so big. They were so tiny when we first got them. They were three days old when we first got them. Now she's getting all of her big girl fur. They're going to be laying eggs for us soon, right? Yeah. That's what you are going to be doing. She's a black astral lork, and all the other chickens are ice browns. Ice browns, I believe is how you say it. And she's the only one that's black, and she's the only one that is her, the black color, and she's the only black astral orb out of the chicks that we have. Uh, we have six of them, if I didn't say that already. So, we have a coop coming soon. They're gonna be outside soon in a few weeks. They're only three weeks, they're about almost three weeks old. They're uh, 17, 18 days, I believe, 18 days old right now. So. We still got a little bit to go. Subscribe to uh, the Monks Animals. I'll put the link in the description. There's a video coming out when they turn, when they're able to go out in the coops. It's gonna be a time lapse of how old they've been and how they've been growing. And uh, just basically of that, chill out. They freak out a little when you pick them up at first, but then when you plop them down, they're all fine, right? All fine and dandy, Daisy. Uh, one of them just hatched. Should we flip it up? Should we? I think maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Go. Look at it. The beetle just hatched. <laughs> Go, dude. We made a little um area for a beetle to live in. Oh, you flipped over. He's good. There's she. He or she. He slash she. Sir and or man. Boom. Now they're in their nice little habitat. We cut up a little piece because they like to be in like caves slash like dark areas. Yeah. This is what it looks like. It's a nice little cave. And we got all our pupa right here. Yeah, all of our pupa. This is our setup. We have pupa right here. Chilling. <laughs> turning into beetles. Beetle now. Beetle enclosure. Uh, and eventually as the days go on, it's going to get more black. Yeah, it's going to get more black in a few days. But it just hatched. And oh, then right here, one. and as you can tell, there's um, there a go. beetle. There's two beetles. There's three. Point, and there's two people. Four. People right here. I see we four. add them to our collection. All right, you add one. There's two. There's four. What I see? Pupa, add to our collection. And last one. Six. Hey, that's fine. This is like a day or two later. This is, I think, a day later, I believe. There's a pupa, and you can tell that they're alive because when you squeeze them, they wiggle and jiggle around. Yeah, but don't squeeze them too hard. Obviously, don't squeeze them too hard. But, and then we'll plop them in there. A nice pupa collection. And now let's check if there's any more in here. We'll update you if we find any more. The update with how much, uh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let him tell you. The update with how much pupa we found. Uh, we found eight new ones. Our little friend. Yo, what is wrong with this the one? The beetle. Yeah, my beetle. Is that one good? Is he still moving? No, it's like, he's like hard and 
with really brown. He good. He's still moving. Yeah. No, they turn brown. That one might have to just be fed off. You can tell. The ones that are like I think of that are really white and pale are the ones that like have just turned into pupa and the ones that are like golden. They've already been pupa for a little bit. Where's your friend? Oh, and there he is. They like it. Look at that. He's chilling under here. I don't know if you guys can see him. Our friend, our little friend is under his little hey, rock. Hey, Gigi, see it with me. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time. Until next time. Stay fanny. Peace.